We've got businesses that are closing left and right, restaurants that will never reopen. Business after business being forced to shut their doors due to the recent COVID-19 restrictions put in place by Governor Andrew Cuomo. Others like Curly's Chicken House fighting to stay open. This restaurant in particular that I own has been here 66 years. It's a staple in our community and our government seems willing to just let it go. But how much longer it can stay open remains unknown. We are hurting desperately. We, we call on our customers, our loyal customers to come out. Please support us. We need them more than ever now. Dozens of local businesses like Crowley's Chicken House have reached out to their local legislator for help before any more businesses have to shut down. New York's 58th District Senator Tom O'Meara also weighing in on the impacts of Governor Cuomo's restrictions, saying that he stands with the businesses. These businesses are dying. They're literally dying. Uh, to go this long for a second time, uh, I don't believe is warranted. Uh, under the circumstances and I'm here with them uh, every step of the way uh, to uh, uh, to help them move forward and to get our businesses uh, back and back open and get people back to work. Senator O'Meara also saying many businesses are operating week to week and based on revenue. He says it's time for Washington to act. It's time that uh, uh, the federal government act uh, and provide some direct relief for these small businesses uh, as we saw with the uh, the initial PPP loans that were out there that that were forgivable as long as the business has stayed in operation. We need we just need to get by. That's all we're asking is just give us enough to survive until we can open back up. Reporting in Shemung County, I'm Ty Wong.